Hey, what's going on viewers and listeners of Student Spotlight? My name is Dylan Thomas and I'm back, believe it or not. Back here for another episode of Student Spotlight. Just felt like it was a few weeks ago and here we are again. Um, I'm really excited here. I have a pretty cool guest. Hi, what's your name and what's your major? Hi, I'm Ariana Puglisi and I'm a dance BFA major with a concentration in performance as well as a minor in business. Awesome. So thank you so much for coming on for Student Spotlight. Um, I know it's a little intimidating with all the cameras, but welcome to our home in the digital studios. It's great to have you. Thank you so much for having me. It's a little bit different from my home, which is a stage, so it has the lights. I'm used to that, but it's a little bit of a different setup. A little bit different. Little There's bit. a few cameras. Uh, there's still some lights, you know, the whole gist. But um, my first question for you is, what's your involvement here on campus? So on campus, I am currently the president of the POM team, which is one of the six dance teams here on campus. And then outside of my dance career, I also am the vice president of finance for the Student Government Association. Um, yeah. Sounds like you do a lot. Normally people who come on, they always do a lot, but those sound like some of the more busier roles on campus. It is for sure. It's my job as the president of POM team to make sure that POM team is doing exactly what we need and set up for success for our competition and performance season. And then with SGA, it's my duty to help make sure that all the student organizations on campus have the necessary funding for their expenditures throughout the year. Woo. Yeah, I would, I would. I could never handle that much. I'm sure you could. Uh, maybe I do. Maybe I don't. I don't know. <laughs> but um, other than, you know, what you do on campus, what do you do outside of campus? Like, did you have an internship recently? Anything like that? Yes. Yeah, so, of course, I, this summer, had the opportunity to work at the Boston Ballet School as a assistant teacher slash intern, which was an amazing mm. experience. I got to spend two weeks in Boston. And I learned so much from one of our amazing professors in the dance program here. Um, and it was an amazing experience that I wouldn't trade for the world. So I have to ask, why do you choose dance of all things? Because um, obviously it's something that you don't typically have classes for in high school. So what kind of drew you to it? So growing up, my sister and I are 10 years apart. And she was always a dancer. And so just me being the little sister, I wanted to follow in her footsteps. So I took into dance pretty quickly, and I found my passion for it and anything else performing. And when it came time to decide what I wanted to do for college, I knew the only thing I wanted to do was dance. When I applied to schools, I applied to 14 different colleges. Dean was my very first tour, and in that moment, I knew that this was going to be my home for the next four years. Well, it's been my home for the four years as well, um, as we're in the same graduating class, obviously. But... Um, my kind of final question here for you is what's one piece of advice you'd have for an incoming student, maybe a freshman coming onto campus? You know, we've been here a while, so, so we kind of know the gist of things, right? We do. My advice to you would be get involved. There are so many amazing opportunities and different activities to do on campus. And my suggestion to any incoming freshman or student at all would just get involved in with what you love to do. And if there's nothing here that you feel is you're passionate about, start a student organization because there are so many opportunities for you to do so and work with the Student Government Association to find something that's just right for you. Um, I definitely improve that SGA shout out as well as, <laughs> you know, if you start your own club, you'll be seeing Ari potentially if you, you need some money. So um, thank you guys so much for watching this week's episode of Student Spotlight. I appreciate it. I hope you have a good day. Remember to like and subscribe. We'll see you all next time. Thank you.